Okay, so keep going. Uh, we have this uh, four by four matrix. Uh, so this one, it asks us to figure out what is the characteristic equation for this given matrix. So it's simple. Nothing, um, you know, too complicated. Uh, you need to write a minus lambda i first, uh, so that basically it's going to be two minus lambda, right? Negative five, seven, three. 0, 1 minus lambda, 5, 0, 0, 2, 4 minus lambda, negative 1, 0, 0, negative 2, negative lambda. So this is what is a minus lambda. Okay. And then you want to figure out the characteristic equation. So this characteristic equation is help us to figure out what is the um, uh, eigenvalue, right? Okay, and uh, which we need to make sure that the determinant uh, of this uh, a minus lambda. Well. I think this is what we can do. The, the best thing for this part is uh, it's going to be 2 minus lambda, right? If we follow uh, the span, follow the first column, so it's going to be times negative 1 to the power of 1 plus 1 times the determinant of this 1 minus lambda, 5 minus 0, 2, 4 minus lambda, negative 1, 0, negative 2, negative lambda, okay? Um, and of course, we can compute the determinant of this one. So that are going to be what? That's going to be 2 minus lambda times well, 1 minus lambda. OK, so let me do this. Times the determinant of 4 minus lambda, negative 1, negative 2, negative lambda. OK. Plus 2 times negative 1 to the power of uh, 2 plus 1. Time. Oh, so this part, you, I forgot to write it down as negative 1 to the power of 1 plus 1, because it's already positive, so just ignore that. Um, so get rid of this. With this, it's going to be 5, 0, negative 2, negative lambda. Okay. Okay, okay so that's, that's how we got here. Um. Okay, so this part, the term of this is simple. So it's a 2 minus lambda times 1 minus lambda. So it's a, uh, this part is a 4 minus lambda times negative lambda minus 2, right? And then this is going to be minus. So it's minus 2 times, well, let's also put a bracket. So it's a 5 times negative lambda minus 0, okay? Okay, so if you want to put everything together, that can give you da, da, da. so two minus lambda, one minus lambda, four minus lambda times negative lambda. Uh, so don't forget about this um, minus two, two times lambda, two minus lambda, one minus lambda, and then for this part, you don't forget this is going to be plus 10 lambda. Okay. Of course, you can expand and then simplify, but I'm not going to do that. Okay, you can leave your answer like this if you want. I think that's perfectly fine. The, the other problem, use the Cromer rule to solve this system. So, so set up this is negative 5, 2, 3, negative 1, right? Uh, okay, so the, the thing of this crime rule is trying to use the determinant uh, to figure out a solution. And uh, so it gives us three matrix. This is original matrix A1, which is you replace the first column with the right hand side, so it's not negative 4, 2, negative 1. Okay, and the A2 which is going to be replace second column. So first column still the same. Negative 5, 3, so it's 9, negative 4, okay. 
we got that and the determinant of this so it's uh, 5 minus 6 so it's negative 1 determinant of a1 so it's a negative 9 minus negative 8 so it's negative 9 determinant of a2 so it's 20 minus 27 so it's negative 7 and again so x1 equals determinant of a1 over determinant of a so it's a 1 x2 equals determinant of a2 over the determinant of a so it's a 7 okay so yeah so that's uh, that's it okay and uh, yeah so that, that, that's it thanks